headed out to any 4th of July parades or festival this week. You probably saw all kinds of displays and new this morning. One group is using those summer festivals to raise awareness about addiction. Nine on your sides. Lisa Smith explains why. This may not be what you expect to see at summer parades, a float filled with people impacted by heroin. In 2016, I lost two children nine months apart. But Roger Wine Miller vowed to make a difference. He and others with Hope Warriors of Blanchester are working hard this summer to help addicts and their families as they attend festive summer events. That we're serious about it. We want the, we want the people to know we're not ashamed of it. We're not afraid of it. We're not shy about it. Why not here? to show them love and support. Blanchester has seen 17 overdoses this year. Lisa Haynes co-founded Hope Warriors of Blanchester. She says this was the first time the group has tried this approach and people are looking for information. I said, we've got numbers on the back of our flyers. You can call us and we'll get people to you. This won't be the first time the group plans to bring their message to festivals like this. They say they want to do it more so that their message gains momentum. The word needs to get out any way possible. And this is one way that we can get the word to our community. In Blanchester, Lisa Smith, nine on your side. Last year, the federal government allocated more than $400,000 to help the opioid problem in Clinton County specifically.